there, welcome to Trail Shoe 101 presented to you by Gazelle Sports. Today we're going to be talking about trail running shoes. Trail running is one of the largest and quickest growing outdoor activities. There's a lot of benefits to it. It's fun terrain, it's a different environment, and it's a little bit more challenging. One thing when going out to the trails, you might want to consider a different type of shoe. Trail running shoes are a little bit more specific to the different types of terrain you'll be experiencing out there. One of the key things that are very different is the outsole. You can see that trail running shoes tend to have a much more rugged outsole. The idea of this is it's going to help you grip the, the grass and the mud and the leaves that you might come across. Keeps you from slipping down and helps you run a little bit more efficiently without having to work to stay upright. Trail running shoes also tend to be a little bit stiffer in the midfoot. The idea is having these kinds of rock plates or stiffened up portion of the shoe protects your foot if you were to hit a rock or a root or some different type of terrain like that that could damage your foot. Having a little bit of stiffer adds just a little bit of extra protection. Now, minimal shoes and redu reduced volume shoes are one of the big things right now with running shoes. You can also find those in trail shoes. You can have a little bit more of a lightweight shoe like a Montreal Rogue Racer, but you can also tend to have a little bit more of a traditional running shoe when you come across some of these Solomon styles like the XR Mission. It's really kind of personal preference when you're out there with what type of shoe, whether minimal or more substantial shoe, but there's still some key things that stay common with them. You'll notice trail shoes tend to have one a little bit more brightly colored, but a little bit more uh, durable uppers. That way if you're running and you snag a branch or anything like that, it's not going to puncture a hole in your shoe. Sometimes you can even find some water resistant shoes that keeps your feet nice and dry during the fall or winter time of trail running, so you're not getting so cold feet. When you shop for a trail running shoe, you're going to have some issues when it comes to finding different types of support. Trail running shoes do not tend to have as much stability as a regular running shoe is. The idea is when you're out there on uneven terrain, the terrain is already very variable, so your foot's already doing a lot of pronation and supination. So in order to help keep your foot nice and stable, they don't necessarily put a ton of stability into it. When you go for your running shoes, try a bunch of them, different brands on. You may see some of your more common brands, like Brooks um, and Saucony, out with some trail options, but then there's some specific trail companies, such as Salomon and Montreal. If you're interested in these types of shoes, come on into Gazelle Sports. We can get you fitted and help you find the correct shoe for you.